Previously on Zakia Loves Pinto. I want the stuff first. I wear lingerie. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> My family just embraces Zakia. <laughs> Get it, mommy. Oh, the jack something. The jacket is working. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh. It's something in the jacket. It's something in the jacket. Oh, <laughs> mommy might be the lead singer. Mommy's hilarious. She is a funny. She's a Gemini. I was, know, just about to say, I was just about to you say know? it must be the Gemini. She's so goofy. <laughs> and she can be serious, but she is so goofy and fun to be around. She teases you and she does. You know, you just don't take it serious. You shoot back. You shoot back. You shoot back. I learned to shoot back. Okay. <laughs> like yeah. she always tell me, like, I don't mean anything and I be yeah. saying she's so goofy. Yeah. She be making these faces in the camera. I be like, girl. It's the faces. <laughs> <laughs> don't do that. Don't do that. Mm -hmm. I don't think a lot of Geminis are funny though. Oh no. Nah. No, but my dad is secretly yeah, funny. Yeah, yeah. They, They're low Geminis funny. are low key funny. Yeah, Secretly yeah. funny. They ain't gonna come all out, but they are funny. They're but funny. also, I think it goes to comfortability. If they're comfortable, they yeah. Okay. Let's go. Love y'all. Love y'all. Love y'all. It's only me. <laughs> my mom is on the phone with my auntie Joy, who lives in Jamaica. My auntie Joy is like one of the most amazing persons ever. She's so nurturing, but her dialect, her patois is so strong because it's like, it's like the country, you know, it's like country. It's so strong that if you don't really understand Jamaican as is, like my baby, you really not gonna understand what she's saying. She talk fast, her accent is deep, and she 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 just be going a hundred miles per hour with it. Yeah, yeah, but we leave now too. Oh God, me too. I'm going to my bed. All right, ma'am. I have a long day today, guys. Joseph Connelly, he went for picking the day one next one. Uh, the other one is the Christmas. Yes, come on, 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 on, Okay. All right. All right. Bye. Bye. Night. Night. Love you. It's so funny because I listen to Jamaican at least once a week. I should really know what's being said, but I think Auntie Joy's accent is so strong. And she's talking so fast, like I understood one of every 10 words, basically. I, I can't wait to get to Jamaica and like meet everybody because I swear I'm gonna come back speaking full on patois. I'm gonna be fluent in it. <laughs> Who the hell call me at 12, two, two o'clock <laughs> on WhatsApp? I'm in the bed. I gotta go to work tomorrow. You don't understand what she was saying? <laughs> and then I'm gonna do something about the bird flu. Mm. I'm like, is that just the flu or is it COVID? Did they have what a bad flu? Oh, the bad flu. I thought she said bird. I was like, the bird flu. I got a call back from the insurance saying that I was denied. So I am a masculine appearing woman you know i love my body however there's things that i would want better and for me it is my breast you know just take it a size down or two they're nice but it's how i envision myself you know growing up in a jamaican household you know i always had to dress in feminine clothes up until really through high school even after i came out when i was 14 i still had to you know, dress like that. And I would sneak and dress 
like a tomboy, but I really couldn't be myself. And you know, it's just how you envision and feel comfortable within your body. And if there's any changes that you want to make, I think you should make it so you can feel good about yourself. They put on paper, I don't know which doctor, but what were the words, Barbados? The reason that she wanted it is because she wanted to become a man. Yo, no, I don't want to be a man. It's so crazy that he would even judge me and assume that because I'm masculine presenting that I want to be a man. I get it. You know, I got called sir from the back, you know, and if you ain't got on your glasses, you know, from the front. But nah, respect to those who do, but I actually enjoy the duality that I am, which is combination of masculine energy and feminine energy and you know i wouldn't want to change that saying that this is due to identity and i did want to go through dr kim because my partner went through kim and he did a great job i don't believe actually dr joseph is the one that said it it had to be him Today's gonna be a long day. I'm gonna pass out in this class. All this, I'm gonna pass out. I'm not ready. I'm really not ready. All right, I need to go put all this together because we have so much work to do. Y'all look at my toes. Stop. I said. An appointment got you a not for my nail. toes no, for my nails. I know I'm talking about a nail lady. And guess what? She somehow because she costs 120 dollars. No, Are you paying 120 dollars for it? I paid for it. You didn't even know the cost. What it was is that you went to her page and found a nail that you didn't like and talked yourself out of it. So don't talk about it because I took initiative of surprising you with a whole nail appointment. So next time you got something to say, you say the facts. Do you hear me? Yes. What's the facts? That you don't know I don't want to hear the facts. That you don't know how to receive. <laughs> facts. Get some blood work done, so. The only reason why they do that shit here is always something I have to do. She's so fine. <laughs> Starbies. No. Right. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Ooh, moving on. Damn. Yeah. Woo, yeah. Hold on, I got it. Family, you know? Need to put a ring on it. 